Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great. And welcome to a new video on a crypto I haven't covered in uh, quite some time. DYDX, it is. Great project, by the way. But in this video, we will focus more on the short-term price action and what's going on. Because DYDX has been pretty bullish for the last, well, let's say, well, over 24 hours. But basically since um, uh, Tuesday evening, so for the last like 36 hours, I would say, has been very bullish. Uh, there are multiple reasons for that. We'll go over those reasons and then we'll just talk about what's most important to you, I think. And that's what's next or what to expect. All right. So we'll, we'll basically cover everything, um, at least everything I think you need to know. If you still have any questions, if you want, still want to discuss anything, we can always do that down in the comments. Or you can join the, 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 the free Telegram group in which I'm very active uh, on Discord as well. I always check Discord as well, but it's a bit less active. Um, so you can do that as well if you want to discuss that. But we'll go over DYDX. Uh, before we dive into that, I do want to mention as well that I have a paid premium trading group in which I share my own trades. I'm a profitable trader, but apart from that, you also gain access to, uh, uh, to an exclusive traders chat room, as you can see, and to my trading guide. So very valuable if you want to become a better and profitable crypto trader for real. Uh, so if you're interested in that, if you want some more information, check out the links down in the description or the pinned comment, and there you'll be able to find out more about it and how to join. But for now, on to DYDX. So the first thing we, we need to talk about, I think, uh, before we talk about the technicals, because obviously there's, there's a lot to say about the technicals as well. I'm sorry that that sound was so loud. At least for me, it was loud, um, but that was an alert. So I might have to check that out after this for a good trade. Um, but the first thing we need to talk about is that the volume where uh, w w which is pumping up DYDX right now is a bit shady. It's not too much, but there's a lot of volume coming from top credit from Super X, which historically, if a lot of volume comes from there, there's manipulation going on. And that's also what you can see. I mean, uh, we, we've been very, very bullish, which isn't necessarily that weird because Bitcoin has been pretty strong as well. Uh, but just in general, most cryptos haven't been this bullish. So there's probably manipulation going on uh, and that's good to know. But in terms of price movement, that doesn't tell you enough because that, that still means that we can, we can be very, very bullish or very, very bearish. So if we then t take a look at the technicals, what you'll see is that we just got a major bullish breakout above 2.15 with the 0 0.786 FIB. But just in general, which you can also see, it's a strong level. So what will happen now is we will probably find resistance in this area between two point, I would say 2.22 and 2.3. All right. So I do think the more bullish momentum is expected from here. And I might have to actually uh, put a new Fibonacci level here like this. So I expect levels like these. All right. So what will happen is that we'll get up there. Uh, that's a bit of a long, uh, <laughs> a long path. We'll get up there. I do still expect with this uh, with this manipulation a resistance and from that resistance we'll we'll retest 2.17 and 2.15 if we can actually hold that for like two days I mean we can get very very high I think we can go all the way up to 2.35 and from 2.35 it's even possible to go all the way up to 2.5 especially with manipulation so one of the biggest things I would take a look at if you're training DYDX is volume if the volume actually from here goes up to 150 or 200 million, well, we have also respected 2.15 and 2.17 and a half as support, we can easily get up to 2.35 and we might even go up to 2.5. For now, that's still a big question because I do expect bullish uh, momentum here. But if we find resistance at 2.25, 2.3, and we drop back down to 2.15 and we barely get any support and we break down below that, then it's just over. Manipulated or not, then it's just, uh, then it's the end of the rally and we'll just drop back down together with the other, other altcoins. So for now, I, I would say the most likely scenario is short-term bullish momentum with a chance to actually extend that, but that's something we need, still need to see confirmation for. All right, so that's my take and that's my analysis on DYDX. If you do have any questions, let me know. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.